I've strived so hard not to believe Junior Pope is dead, but the way things is going, I think I just have to let that be. Because I've tried to fight to see many proof, you know, many things to believe this guy is not dead, but the way things is going, things is going too fast and showing that the guy is actually dead. Like, anyway, welcome back to my YouTube channel if you're watching my video for the very first time. I want to encourage you to go ahead and hit the subscribe button and also do me a favor to turn on the notification bell icon so whenever I put out a new video on this beautiful channel, you'll be among the first to put to get the notification and you know share your own comments in the comment section. So today being Friday 26th of April 2024, I think the family of um late junior pope has finally released um the day they are going to bury him, and that's why I'm here to you know to also share with you guys the date they actually you know choose to bury our legend junior pope so junior pope is a very very good actor you know he's a very very good actor sorry and you know he acts very well he, play, he plays his role very well and something i know about him one slang i know about him more is that he said you always say who does that that's one thing i know if you say who does that um junior pope always comes to my mind so um funeral arrangement for the burial of the late nollywood actor john paul Udunwudu have been released by his family. Junior Pope and four other actors drowned after their boat capsized in the Adan Anambra River in Anambra State, okay, on April 10 while returning from a movie shoot, okay. On the 12th individual who boarded the ill um fatted boat, only seven were um, rescued alive while five died, including Junior Pope. So the details of the funeral arrangement for the late actor signed by Divine Odunwudu on behalf of the family indicated that beside the April 23 requiem mass at St. John Mary Venny Parish in Aceba, Delta State another requiem mass is scheduled to be held at Christ the King Catholic Parish GRA Enugu on May 13. So on May 14, an evening of tributes and you know candle light will follow at the you know Amadio event center in Enugu at 5 p.m. A wake will follow on May 16 at his country home in Uwala, Abaka Ukehe, a community in Ibo Etiti, local government area of the state. So Pope will be buried on Friday, May 17. At his country home after a burial mass at St. Peter's Catholic Church, Ukehe. Interment will follow immediately after the burial of the actor. The burial arrangement will be wrapped up with a Thanksgiving mass at St. Peter's Catholic Church, Ukehe, on May 20. So this um the um the Tuesday that they're going to you know you know put lay him to rest is on May 17 in a stand. So let me hear your own opinion in the comment section. What do you actually think? And is there any... Oh, I can't even say there's hope for now that he's still alive. Because the way things are going, his family have actually come and announced the date they are going to lay him to rest. And we have to just believe and, you know, move on that Junior Pope has already left the um, Nollywood industry. And, you know, he's not coming back again. But I still pray a miracle can be done nothing is impossible in the sight of god so share your own opinion in the comment section tell us what you actually think that can be done in this constant you know death of nollywood actor and actually before he actually died you know some prophet and prophetess have actually come out to give prophecy on why on um, something that will happen to him you know during a um, movie shot but people didn't take it serious the video didn't trend because that video is a very very reasonable video you know when a video is you know reasonable and you know carries vital information most times it doesn't trend okay so the video didn't trend but when the incident actually happened and when people go back to hear the information the prophetess was trying to pass they now see that you know she's saying something very very reasonable and it's actually come to pass so don't joke with visions you know no matter how it's it sounds not all visions you joke with because you know i don't blame people because there are many fake pastors and many fake prophets around so people don't know the right one to believe but if you see if they give a vision and you see that it matches with what you have already think before kindly do the needful to avoid it okay so share your own opinion in the comment section what you actually think 
and i'll be glad to reply each and every one of you in the comment section see you in my next video have a nice day ahead